welcome to this series. This series is called Quick and Light Tutorials. In this quick tutorial, I'm going to cover filters for you. As the name suggests, they are really quick and I just cover simple parts of um, and light and I don't go into too much depth or into anything that's advanced so it's it's more for basic users and I'm just going to cover filters and some of the things that you can do with filters be really quick so um, from my menu at the top bar here um, the three little bars I'm just going to then select filters and I get three drop downs and let's just concentrate on black and white at the moment so I've got my image and then I can just go, go along and select whichever filter I want. Now to change the intensity on any given filter, all I'm gonna do, this slider along the top, I'm gonna to slide it left and right, and you will see that on the bottom, the numbers around the thumbnail show you what intensity I'm using with that um, filter. So I'm just gonna click the X button to close that filter. Now I'm gonna go back and select analog. Um, I'm gonna just show you a quick, um, another tip that you can use with filters. If I choose this, this russet filter um, here, or even, um, no, yeah, we'll stick with the russet filter. And I select at around um, 82 um, on the intensity. And then I click my little tick button, top right hand side, and then I can fill it with another filter on top of the russet filter that I just used. And just for this demo, I'm gonna use Duo. Duo are just filters that you've got vignette in here, um, which makes the outsides darker. But Duo are just filters either um, in a circular, um, circular fashion or a linear, and it's just two colors per filter. So I'm just gonna use this, um, this Italia right here and you'll see I get this circle on my screen now I can pinch and squeeze this circle to extend that filter or I'm just gonna make that filter a little bit smaller and then with these arrows you see I can twist these arrows I just select one of them and then um, it's the outer part of the filter so it it makes it a little bit more smoother so that's filters in a nutshell really really simple really really easy I'm gonna select my tick button so I've used two filters on top of a single um, russet filter I've used two filters on top of each other which is quite easy to do as well to save it out click the um, little square with the arrow and then save photo and then that saved photo will be on my left hand side bottom left hand side of my screen so this is really quick tutorial really really simple and I'll be back again with some more catch you soon bye